Welcome back everyone to part two of the rundown of YouTube equipment for 2017 that you may require in order to start your own professional YouTube channel if you want to have YouTube as a professional career like I am trying to do right now. Now again, if you saw my previous video, which I will link in the description below, I went over the prices of each item that is required in order to create fully professional, well-edited, well-audible, and properly laid out videos for YouTube. Now I'm going to unbox all of these items that you may require. And again, same with me. This is my first time unboxing all these items. This is my first time experiencing handling items like these for proper videos to handle for YouTube. They are very well equipped with each different unique ways of handling your own uh, total ways of how you want to express yourself through editing, through personalizing these items. It is a way to basically put a stamp on this is you, this is your trademark, and that is what your equipment will be showcasing on how you will trademark your brand through YouTube while using all this equipment. Now, so far, my brand has been not editing, recording with my phone, just doing simple type of recording on a screen with my phone. So this is all very exciting to me, and I hope it's exciting for you. If you're new, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, it's always great to see you. Now, let's dig in. So first of all, we're going to start with the Dragon Pad Pop Filter. Again, this is a filter for your microphone. When you open the box immediately, that is exactly what comes in, just a plastic wrap with the actual pop filter within the box. You take it out, it is very, very light, very efficient, very easy to carry around, so it's portable. Again, you can bend it in different ways. You can use it to equip your own audio microphone, depending if it is a blue snowball, or if it is a different type of microphone, even if it's a Blue Yeti or something else, it comes with a twisting stand so you can tighten it, you can loosen it, depending on your preference. And again, I got all these items on Amazon, the pop filter, the blue snowball microphone, and the Game Capture HD Elgato. And usually, you can buy any item individually. However, this instance, when I was trying to buy an Elgato, Amazon recommended that usually the most frequently bought items together as a three pair was the Elgato, the mic, filter, and the mic itself. And again, very easy. It may seem big, big as my face, but this is supposed to filter out any extra sound in the background, any banging, any construction, any people, noisy neighbors. I have a lot of those. So this will be very helpful for your endeavor for making your audio even sound more clear than it already is. Second of all, of course, we have the Blue Snowball itself. There are two separate packages that come within the actual box of the Blue Snowball Black Ice Edition for the microphone. There are the ball itself for the microphone, which is very easy. Just twist the top off and it's easily adjustable. Very shiny, very new. Different settings, you have the port for the USB, you actually have the cable, and you have audio ends on both sides to range your voice. If you're right near it, away from it, it works out just as well for both types of dialogue and commentary that you wanna provide for your videos. Next is a second box that comes in with the main box. This holds the stand for the microphone. This is actually what keeps the microphone standing, what keeps it upright, what you want to use to adjust it. This is the stand, actually. It's a tripod stand, like a Doc Ock tentacle claw, any of you Spider-Man fans. So this is the stand for the microphone. Works out just as much as efficient as you would for a normal microphone, like my phone I'm using. And here comes the actual cord that you can use to plug in to the microphone, have it stand on the stand, and extend it if you want to. It will work out fantastically. You can plug this into your laptop, have your audio go from the microphone into your laptop or PC, and it'll work spectacularly. It is a very well efficient mic. Blue Yetis are said to be really good as well, but a Blue Snowball, again, watch legit MHX's videos. He uses a microphone just like this, and his audio is fantastic. He just did a video recently about Spider-Man PS4. He's back on YouTube. He's going to continue his YouTube how-to series. I'll put that in the description so you can check it out. It's totally awesome. Then, of course, in the box, you get a nice instruction manual, 
how to handle everything, what type of setup you may require. It's in Spanish and English, so it helps both bilingual people of all ethnicities. Very helpful, very awesome, very efficient packaging as well. The packing for these items is not a hassle at all. It took me just like a minute easily to take it out. Super, super clean. Now the big grand finale here is the Elgato, the game capture card, what you will mostly require in order to do fully adaptable and fully edited and in-depth gameplay videos. Now, for those of you who do not have access to an Elgato, there are alternatives. You can go out and buy a stand for either a camera, like an actual camera, or your phone that you can use your camera to record things. Have it stand, set it on a table, and put it in front of your TV so you can record the visual for your TV while you're recording your voice in the background. The visual might not come out crystal clean, but it is a good alternative. The stand that you can put on for your phones, like a selfie stick or something like that, usually like $20, $25. Not that much, not that bad of a price, but still, Elgato is $135. The blue snowball is like $65, and this dragon pad filter is only $8. So really steady price. It's about less than $200, depending on what type of equipment you buy, if it's new or old. This is all from Amazon, by the way. Very efficient, very proper, and it is going to be amazing, because I've never handled anything like this. I'm super excited to give you guys Radioactive Replay, where I play through all of the Spider-Man games. It's going to be super fun, and I can't wait for you guys to enjoy it. So, the second one right here is the Elgato, of course. It comes in this little box that is kind of like a bookshelf for the main box that it comes in. Very efficient. You just slide it out. It's already like this. It's like a book. You open it. The Elgato is right there, looking very sly. You take it out. There's a quick start how-to guide on how to use your Elgato, how to equip it. Very helpful. Take it out. The Elgato is right here. Nice plastic wrap, HDMI cables, ports, all that stuff in the back and the front. This is the standard one. This is the standard Elgato, so it just works out for Xbox One, PS4, PS3, PS2. Handhelds, I think, if you can equip it in a certain way with certain cables, but it works out really well from the videos that are on YouTube of people showing that, which I will try to find and put in the description of a nice tutorial for an Elgato. Then you open it again. There's a second hatch with the wires and the cables and everything. You open it up. You take it out. Here is a standard USB port slash HDMI cable that goes for the Elgato into your system slash um, laptop or PC. You have actual port cables. Again, if you want to play a PS2 game or an older generation console like an Xbox, the original Xbox, not the Xbox One, the first Xbox, you can use these two, help out. And then you have an HDMI cable, simple, can help out, plug that in into your TV or into your laptop, and you have the power cord cable for any other types of purposes to charge it and also to apply it to other lesser consoles. This is great great items here. Any item that is similar to these can be used for proper editing videos and proper commentary for anything like this. Again, I've never experienced anything this amazing. I cannot wait to try it out for you guys. It might take me a while to figure out how all this stuff works, so Radioactive Replay might take a little while, but I will start as soon as I can. However, there have been four videos that I made recently that I have not responded to your comments in. I love you guys, and I'm going to respond to all of them right now after this video is over. So I'm super excited. This is a great haul of great, great appliances for you to make proper YouTube videos so everyone can enjoy. So thank you so much for watching, everybody. I hope this was helpful. Any questions you have, answer in the comments. I will be there as soon as I can, I promise. But until then, stay spectacular, everybody. Peace out.